If you have potatoes and onions at home, make this delicious recipe for your dinner. To start our recipe, I will cut an onion into thin slices this way. Now I will cut four potatoes in half and then also in thin slices. That way I'm doing it. I'm sure this recipe will impress you. In a large pot, I will add enough oil. And then I will put our potatoes. I will stir a little so that all the potatoes are covered by the oil. And let it fry a little. Now I will add our slices of onion. I will stir a little more and let it fry until the slices of onion are browned. Once it is well fried, I will put the potatoes with onions in a calendar to be able to drain all the all that was left in our recipe. I have no doubt that you and your family will love this recipe. Do it at your house and then come and tell me what you thought. I will love to know. Now in a container, I will add six whole eggs, a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of black pepper and stir well. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Melissa Walker from New Zealand. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. Now I will add the potatoes with onions in our eggs and I will stir well to mix all the ingredients. Then in a frying pan, I will add a little olive oil. And with the help of a culinary brush, I will spread the olive oil throughout the frying pan. Next, I'll add all our recipe in the frying pan. And I'll fix a little so that the whole recipe covers the frying pan. I'll cover and let it cook for 10 minutes. After a while, with the help of a plate, I will turn our recipe in the frying pan and cover it again to cook on both sides. Now our recipe is ready. I doubt you've ever tasted any potato omelets. As good as this one. See how we can make an amazing recipe with few ingredients. I have no doubt that you will come back here to thank me for having taught you how to make this wonderful omelet. I'm sure you and your whole family will love it. As soon as you taste this recipe, I can't stop doing it since the first time I tasted it. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I see you in the next video. Bye.